traitor's hope shattered. Sussex hoisted by own petardas cannot afford minimal respect from royal. Experts get candid about the rare opportunity Prince Harry, Meghan Markle have been offered to win back UK Prince Harry and Meghan Markle have been offered a once-in-a-lifetime rehabilitation opportunity, according to royal experts. Jonathan Sacadotti, a royal expert and commentator, has made this assertion. He got candid over it all while speaking with the royal US and was quoted saying, I don't personally imagine Meghan coming to the UK very easily, she may prove me wrong. But people here have such a low opinion of her if not both of them these days that I think she'd be very brave to come back to the UK. I do still say if they could come back and if they could not be front and center, keep it quiet, but just come back to help celebrate this milestone for not just the Queen but for the whole country for British history. He also added, then that will probably be very nice and it might rehabilitate them somewhat towards the British people. I don't really think that's their style anymore, they don't like to do things quietly, they don't like someone else to be the center of attention when they're around. I think that where Harry and Meghan go, it's the Harry and Meghan show and I think that means that it probably would be better if they didn't come and steal the limelight from the Queen. But who knows, let's watch this space and let's hope that if they can come they'll do it in a nice way and that it will be an opportunity for the whole family to enjoy being together and to put all that behind them. Previously, Prince Harry has been mocked as locals didn't even recognize him when he made an appearance at a Texas rodeo over the weekend, according to an attendee. The Duke of Sussex, 37, was spotted at the Stockyards Championship Rodeo event on Saturday. Sporting a casual outfit and a cowboy hat, Prince Harry mingled among locals at the Cowtown Coliseum in Fort Worth, Texas, where the event was hosted. A snap of Harry was shared on Instagram by numerous users, including the Stockyards Championship Rodeo Secretary Cindy Reid. The photo shows the Duke in conversation with numerous others who are also wearing cowboy hats. Cindy accompanied the photo with a caption reading, where was Prince Harry Saturday night? Ooh, just hanging out behind the bucking chutes at the Stockyards Championship Rodeo. Love it. Thank you for the visit. While there, Harry is said to have joined the crowds to watch bull riding events and reportedly joked that he would have taken part if he hadn't lost his rigging bag. Prince Harry hanging out at the rodeo this week, posted the Melton Bull Company, which grows and trains bulls, according to People. We have a lot of rodeo royalty here, but this is the first time I've seen a prince. Said he was going to enter the bull riding but the airline lost his rigging bag. However, the outlet claims the image was posted and then deleted by the company's owner former bull rider turned trainer Corey Melton. According to one source, at the event where animals are made to perform, the Duke went largely unrecognized. The Duke was mocked by the individual who claimed many of those in attendance didn't recognize him. The source told the Daily Mail, the funny thing is most people didn't recognize him or care. The attendee went on to claim that Harry's appearance at the event was shocking. They accused him of showing a lack of respect by attending despite his wife Meghan Markle's support for animal rights. The source said, it's a quintessentially American event, where animals are made to perform. Given he has such a lack of respect for the First Amendment and his wife is such an animal rights activist, it is shocking he thought he could show his face here. Meghan is a keen advocate for animal activism and reportedly talked the Duke out of the annual Boxing Day hunt in 2017. Conservationist Dr. Jane Goodall previously told the Radio Times that Harry and his brother William hunt and shoot. But I think Harry will stop because Meghan doesn't like hunting. 